Prism reflex test PBRT first described by Krimsky has become universally accepted as a practical method of estimating the size of the angle of squint in patient with a blind or deeply amyloidic eye with or without eccentric fixation. Required instruments Prism bar or loose prisms Pen torch Optical principle the optical principle is different to the prism reflection test as the prism is placed before the fixing eye and the fixing eye moves to overcome the prism and maintain fixation in the primary position. Because of firing's law, each eye will make a conjugate movement of the same amount. If an increasing prism strength is placed before the fixing eye, this will centralize the corneal reflection of the deviating eye. Procedure To perform the test, patient is asked to fixate on a point light and prisms of increasing strength with apex toward the direction of manifest squint are placed in front of the normal fixating eye till the corneal reflex is centered in the squinting eye. The power of prism required to center the light reflex in the squinting eye equals the amount of squint in prism diopters. To avoid errors from parallax, the examiner must observe the corneal reflex with one eye by sitting directly in front of the deviating eye while keeping his other eye closed. Recording PBRT with or without glasses, 35 prism base out, fixing right. Advantages of Krimsky test Since the test requires only that the patient fixate the light being entirely objective, otherwise it is useful in testing small children. It is quicker to perform than the prism cover test. It can be used in patients in whom the deviating eye has a low visual acuity or has lost central fixation. Limitations of the Krimsky test Since the angle kappa is included in the measurement, the test is inaccurate. It is impossible to perform the test for distance fixation since the position of the examiner's head requires to obtain an accurate observation prevents the patient from seeing the fixation light. Kindly subscribe the channel and press the bell icon. Thank you for watching.